Now, whether these exams are going to be difficult or easy is going to be a lot to do with your mentality. If you're just going to approach them like, ah, oh, this is just like any other exam, you know, you're setting yourself up for one of the, like the 43% of people who fail. Okay, you need to go into this knowing that there's a huge amount of information. A lot of it's very difficult. A lot of it's new to you. And you have to change the way you do things to be able to get through. We know that the old way doesn't work. 43% fail. So you have to change what you're doing. You're going to need to change the way you study from a, a reading um, focused study method to a practice exam. Identify the gaps. Go to the textbook. Use the memory and study techniques that I teach you and then come back and retest yourself and work out what is the best study method for you. Okay, you're going to need to learn to prioritize your study over other things. You're going to have to say no to other things. You know, there might be a week or two where you can't go to chick kids sport, where you need to get someone else to do it, where you can't go to this, that and the other, uh, where you can't go out and have a big night out. You have to prioritize or you're just not going to get through this. Okay, you've got to change the way you study from passive to super active study and we'll teach you how to do that in this series and you have to do the work you, you can't just skim through this and do no work okay but you can do far less work if you do it the right way if you're very active as you study and if you study the right content now the other thing is this you have to want to learn okay you have to want to learn as much as possible so that you're not a dangerous pilot after getting through your exams